Hello, hello to all the cool kids out there. Thank you guys for joining me tonight. I am Daisy Collins of TsunamiRose.net and I am here. Oh my gosh, my video looks so red. That's weird. My hands look so red. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> we're here. We are making embellishments from our scraps. That's what we'll be doing this week. So if you enjoy junk journal related videos, I do post a video pretty much every single day. So do hit that subscribe button and hit that like button if you guys find something informational in this video. So um, we're working with a couple of paper pads uh, this week. We'll be working with, I have this paper pad here called Gold Foil. Why are my little hands so <laughs> red that's what i want to know so anyways i can't change it now <laughs> wait wait i might be able to my hands are so red why are they so red i don't know my hands are really red and that's not working now hang on a moment i thought i had this oh my gosh my hands are purple <laughs> oh my god goodness is that better that's a little bit better okay okay at least my hands aren't purple so we're working with a couple of paper pads uh this week we are working with this paper pad right here called gold foil matte stack by dcwv i am also working with this paper pad here called the maps text and ledgers stack also by D dcwv and i'm also working uh with another dcwv paper stack and i'll be able to link all of these paper pads at the very end um in the details box down below um for you guys that are watching the replay and this one is called botanical beauty and it has all sorts of pretty papers i've already pretty much cut up half of the paper pack so that's going well <laughs> and supporting papers right here i thought i would hit it with a little bit more, more gold foil the paper pad has some gold foil but i want a little bit more so yeah who is here durinda is here hi welcome welcome so i have already torn up all the paper lucky for you guys i did that before <laughs> um and so i have a little bit of each paper pack here uh hey q-tips you've been waiting for this <laughs> okay so i got my paper clips here so that i can make my little collages um i do like to use the edge of my We Are Memory Keepers mini uh, folding board to make kind of straight cuts across the paper. Thank you everybody for joining me. Um, if you're new here, let me know that you're new and I'll join. I'll let you uh, join the cool kids group here. We're the cool kids of junk journaling. I have a brand new group if you guys haven't joined it. It is uh, Junk Journal Cool Kids over on Facebook. So you guys are more than welcome to join us. We're going to be posting junk journal related stuff. Hey, Kat is here. And Claudia is new. Welcome, welcome to uh, the junk journal cool kids. I am Daisy Collins of TsunamiRose.net. So here's this the first one if you guys didn't see. I usually like to do kind of like uh, three pieces of paper put together. That's kind of my little formula that works for me. So I kind of grabbed one from the paper stack, one foil, and then one from the paper pad of the text and ledger papers. So that looks good. I don't know why my hands look so red. <laughs> I promise my hands are not that red. <laughs> I can't fix it. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just going to go with it right now. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Got a little bit of a rose right there. I want to use that. I want to thank everybody so much for joining me today. Um, what else are we going to do here? I want to put one of these neutral papers, but I don't want to cover up the rose. <laughs> Decisions. 
Ooh, I gotta try not to cover up those, but it happens. It happens. <laughs> I hope everybody had a good weekend. Hey, Purple Paisley Planner, how are you? Let's see here. Let me go through some more of these. Let's see, tear this one up a little bit. And then, what do we pick here? What do we pick? We can put some pink in it. Like that with some pink. Good afternoon in Australia. Love those new papers, right? Isn't this paper stack pretty? It's a couple paper stacks that I have that I'm using tonight. Um, welcome, welcome to all of our new cool kid friends. Thank you guys for joining us. Just having fun here making some embellishments. Just tearing up some paper. We started with the new paper pack this week, finally. <laughs> it's hot, windy Tuesday. Oh, I wish it was hot. Well, not really. I don't really want to say that being in Las Vegas. <laughs> I really don't want it to be that wind that hot yet. Uh, what am I saying? Because <laughs> it's coming. Like I know it is. <laughs> This is a good mix right here. Gold foil papers and then the paper pad papers. They look really good. Oh, look at this purple. And then maybe I could use this. Yeah, let's do that. It's not a rule that it has to be those three combos. <laughs> uh, let's see. Right there. That's so pretty. And these are so easy to make. They just, I forget how fast they are to make. And then I end up making way too many. <laughs> but it is fun. Let's see. That's why I could spend hours just doing this right here. Mac Jewelry is here. Welcome. All the cool kids are stopping by to say hi. <laughs> How exciting. I hope everybody had a good weekend. And I hope everybody had a good Monday. Hope your Monday wasn't terrible. You have me hooked with these. I spent about 15 hours ripping up paper and clipping them together. Right? Oh my gosh, you're gonna... Ugh, you need a... I've, I usually, you know, I usually make a lot of them and then I sew them together, but I really need to, like, do the opposite. <laughs> I need to sew them as I go along, I think. So... Let's do some of that right there. That looks good. Who's here? Bonnie is in Ohio. <laughs> All right. If you're not a member of the Cool Kids group on Facebook, let me log in and get you the link. Of course. I'm not logged into Facebook. I don't know why. Oh, and I typed it in wrong. <laughs> Come on, Facebook. Okay, oh, that hurt my back. Okay, so let me get the link. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, so if you guys join this group here, that's where I post... If I'm going to go live midday, or I pretty much post uh, throughout my name, throughout the day. We have all the cool kids in there posting about what junk journals they're doing. 
So if you want to join a fun group, join the Gentry the Cool Kids because we're cool. <laughs> Let me see. I'm going to pick. Oh, I want some of those green. But I want like a thicker, thicker green page. Or do I want this? Because this looks pretty also. Ooh, let's do that. Because that is gorgeous. With peach. <sighs> Thank you for joining. I'll go ahead and approve you right after that I go live. <laughs> and you can see what everybody's up to. Everybody's welcome to post what junk journals they're working on. Or if you worked on something similar to mine, let me know. Ooh, these two papers right here. That reminds me of, like, it's so like Betsy Johnson right here. These, this two mix. <laughs> this mix right here. I like it. It is so pretty. With that, with that pretty. Ooh. Okay, who knew my, putting together things with paper clips is so hard? <laughs> okay, hey Tammy, welcome. Kayla said she just joined. She just joined the cool kids. Welcome. I'll, I'll let you uh, in in a moment once I get off the live. <laughs> You'll see what everybody's up to and my design team posts there. Um, they'll post their projects that they do using my printables there as well. It's just a fun group, you know. What am I missing here? I don't know. I kind of like these two, just these two together. <laughs> the Easy Made a Junk Journal with some mystery pieces. I'm going to give it to my daughter's teachers for Valentine's Day. Oh, how pretty. I hope you took pictures. I hope you took pictures. Let's do these two. This, what else? Ooh, we'll put this part right here. <clears throat> uh, Mac Jewelry says, I sew by hand and I have no sewing machine yet. Oh my goodness. I bet that looks pretty, though. I forgot about hand embroidery. I used to do that in middle school. I remember. I used to try and get way too elaborate for my attention span. <laughs> but I remember I had a lot of fun with it. Doing those little, like, flowers and all that stuff. All those different stitches. I remember doing that. That was fun. Let's see. Let's get some more of these different papers. I have all sorts of different papers here. Loving the gold foil, you guys. Oh, my goodness. Hey, Keisha. Sorry I haven't gotten back to you. I will. I've just been super busy. Life. <laughs> Life. Okay, so we got this here, this here, this here. I could see how that would go together. Lizzie's here. Hey, Lizzie. Hi, Tina. Thanks for joining us tonight. My hands look way too red. I just can't fix it on camera. I don't know why. <laughs> Trust that my hands are not this red, though. I don't. I don't think so. <laughs> I look like I have a bad sunburn on screen, <laughs> but I don't. I really don't. <laughs> and let's see. I have one of these. That look pretty. More like the sticker one. It's just on screen. It just looks really weird on screen. I don't know why. I ran out of time to fix it. 
And right now, I I think I could try and fix it, but like, I can't see the <sighs> I can't see the footage of my hands while I adjust the controls. So that makes no sense. It makes no sense. What else do we have here? I have a bunch of stuff. I just got started. This paper pad, so pretty. So pretty, and then the gold foil. Mm. You guys picked a good paper pad. Camera exposure set weird. Yeah, it's just... Like I said, like I go to like try and fix it, but I can't see my hand. Let me see. See, that doesn't fix my hand, though. Mm. No, it's not the exposure. <laughs> it's not the brightness. Maybe it's the contrast. Oh, there we go. Maybe, I think it's the contrast. Okay. <laughs> okay, so I had the contrast a little high. <laughs> There we go. See, my hands are not that red. <laughs> Much better. Thank you. <laughs> okay, cat, you have a good night, hon. Yeah, I'm like, I don't have a sunburn. It's just the camera. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I don't know what I've done. <laughs> Some of these kind of look good just on their own, but I like to put three instead. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Let's do these three. And if you're just joining me, um, let me show you the paper pads I'm using. I'm using this paper pad by DCWV called Gold Foil. Um, it's basically all DCWV paper pads, I noticed. I'm using... This one uh, called the Maps, Text, and Ledger. I'm also using this one called, which is all the print, is Botanical Beauty. So they're all by DCWV, right? They were all on sale. That's why I got them. <laughs> There's a DCWV sale going on. <laughs> so I'm all about that. And that is what I'm using today. Pretty much. That's what we're working with. Let's see, what do we have here? What, what else do I have? That could look pretty on this brown paper. Okay, let's do it. Again, I'm pretty much just putting together three pieces of paper. <laughs> Just arranging them in different ways. The botanical ones. Aren't they pretty? These are going to make pretty junk journals when I get the junk journals done. After I get some embellishments. <sighs> I'm excited. I think it will look pretty, pretty, pretty. And let's see. If I want to use brown paper, I should use this paper right here. Look, look pretty right there. And these are so easy to put together, you guys. So easy. I can't forget this one. With the gold foil. And then we need some of this neutral paper. Somewhere. Oh, it could be like that. Yeah, that's pretty with the matte paper. I like it. Oh, and I want to thank everybody who um, purchased a junk journal for my shop. There's still some available. Um, I appreciate the support. There's actually one that I didn't even, I forgot to list it. <laughs> So I'll have to um, do kind of a flip through, maybe at the end of the video when I'm all done with the live, I'll do a flip through video. 
because I need to have like, you know, the, the flip through on video. <laughs> okay, so we have this orange here. What do you use these for? Can you show a finished one? A finished uh, one of these embellishments? Yeah, um, I'm an, I'm, I got a nice little pile. I'll probably get to sewing them. But um, basically, like for example, this is one that I did with other paper pads. Just put a bunch of papers together and I do have lace, so I'll probably put some lace together. And I just use it to decorate the back of this. And I used a light pink thread, so you can't really see the thread right there. But it just looks pretty on the top of this page right here. Um, you could also, let me see, let me get the stuff that I made last the last couple months. Um, yeah, so I pretty much use these scraps to do a lot of things. Like I decorated pretty much all of these tags kind of in the scrap style. this pocket also in the scrap style design I like it it's a nice effect so that's what, I, that's what we're doing we're making embellishments I will also do things like this where I'll sew it um, onto book paper like this this is a book page and then I'll include this into the signature of my journal so it gives it kind of a de decor. Hey, Janet. It gives it kind of decor without having to be too bulky. And it's really, really simple. And, you know, it looks cuter than you think. <laughs> so we're going to make a couple more. We're already at half hour. So let me do this for another eight minutes. <laughs> and then we'll get to sewing. And... So basically what I do is I'll pick a paper pad and I'll basically tear it apart, make embellishments, and then I make the junk journals. So right now we're making embellishments and we're going to make junk journals probably next week. <clears throat> it just makes it uh, the process a whole lot easier making the junk journals. And on some of them, I'm going to make another pack after this. I'm going to make another set and I'm going to use actual die cuts. So it's going to be really pretty, I think. I think, I think. This is kind of a tropical look. I don't know. I think it looks nice. I think it's nice. Tropical and neutral with the gold foil. I love it. Makes me want to go to Florida or something. <laughs> Daisy, if you sell those giant tags, I'll be happy to grab it. Yes, I'm going to, I'm going to be working on that probably tonight. Working on putting the um, embellishments up for sale in my shop. So if you want to check them out tomorrow morning, I'm going to say that they're going to be there because I need to do it. <laughs> I need to do it. So I'm going to work on that tonight right after I get off live. Eh. Okay. If you go to Florida, you'll be close to me then. <laughs> I've actually never been to Florida. But I don't know. When is it? When is it not? I don't like humidity. <laughs> I have found that out about myself lately. I don't like humidity. <laughs> so when is it not humid in Florida? I don't know. It has little pineapples, y'all. How cute are the little pineapples? <laughs> Daisy, do you sell the ephemera you make? I need a <laughs> get a bag full. I'm actually yeah, I'm gonna be I'm I am gonna be selling these. And I'm also going to be selling the ephemera that I made um, last time that I made ephemera. So look out for that. This will be on sale, I don't know, probably soon. <laughs> I'm terrible. I need to take pictures of everything. and uh, 
I want to wait till I make more. It's a whole dilemma. <laughs> Let's see, I think these might be too small. Spring break is very nice in Florida. Okay. As long as it's not humid. Ugh, I can't deal with humidity, you guys. I just, ugh. I went to Texas in November. The first week of November. And I annoyed myself <laughs> with how much I complained about how humid it was. I could not deal. <laughs> I could not deal with the humidity. <laughs> I was so annoying. <laughs> and I just couldn't believe that people would say that that was better than Las Vegas weather. Because no, it's not. <laughs> it's not better. <laughs> it is so not better. <laughs> Like how? <laughs> it's humid compared to the West. You used to live in West Palm Beach. Which part of Texas? I went to San Antonio. My my siblings live in San Antonio, so that's where I went. That's where I hung out. If you hear any talking, that's my husband. He's playing video games. <laughs> He's doing his dude thing. Let's see. I need... I need something. Maybe this? Yeah, okay, that'll work. Uh, you have three dehumidifiers for just the humid season. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I haven't made these type of embellishments in a long time. I'm excited working along with you. There you go. Let's get it. Let's get it done. <laughs> now I don't even want to put three. <laughs> I'm so weird. Okay. So we have this little vegetable thing here. Image. I want to show that off because that's cute. Oh, they look cute with the little polka dots. The little polka dots, yes. Okay. I don't. Even, I don't even know what a dehumidifier would look like. <laughs> what would that even look like? And then I'll put this right here, like that. That is so pretty. Okay, I got two more minutes to come up with whatever I can come up with so I can sew it together. Oh my god, this makes me so nervous. <laughs> I'm so nervous! Okay, okay, okay. Oh my gosh, it's a race. It's a race. <laughs> okay, it looks like a big rectangle air filter. Really nice. Cool. Very cool. Let's see what else. What else can I do? What else can I do? <sighs> okay, this is cute. Okay, oh my gosh, I have like 60 seconds. Ah! <laughs> I'm scrambling. You know, there's like a very specific part of this that I want to use. And what else? No, is there something dark, something black? Where's there more of that? Gosh darn it. This is what I want. Yes, this right here. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, that's the last one. 
Okay, so, oh my gosh. I got, <laughs> I got all this stuff. <laughs> Hang on, I gotta... I gotta clean off my desk or it's gonna drive me crazy. <clears throat> One moment. While I package everything up before I bring it out again. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Sylvia. What are you saying? So I am an chiatic. Sylvia hates it. Sylvia hates tea. Uh-oh. But how could you hate cinnamon tea? It's so good. <laughs> cinnamon tea is so good. I haven't had it in a while. I should make it. I have cinnamon. Okay. Okay. So that's put away. Now we have this right here. Okay. Let me get another bag. Where are the little bags? Where are the little bags? Okay. Oh, wait. They're right here. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Lately, everything I'm like, I can't find it. I can't find it. It's literally right there. I don't know what's wrong with me lately. <laughs> I don't know. There must be something. <laughs> so I like to group all of the papers together that belong to the same paper patch. That just makes sense to me. Okay. Pretty papers, huh? Pretty, pretty, pretty papers. Oh, uh, you know what I, you know what I love, and it's only good at my grandma's house. Uh, whenever I go to my grandma's house in Mexico, she has this lemon tree, and you just pluck the leaves off the lemon tree, and you make a tea out of that, and it tastes so good. It's amazing. Okay, so I'm going to show my sewing machine. I always show off my sewing machine. This is the Brother Project Runway CE1125PRW. Um, CE1125PRW. And that is the sewing machine that I love to use. It's my babies. So... I have brown thread in there right now. But that's only because that's what I was using before. I want to try and figure out maybe what color would look nice. Maybe black would look nice with this one, though. Um, yeah, I think I want to say black would look really nice. <clears throat> so let's go with that. Could also use some orange, maybe. It would look nice also with some orange. I'm just looking down here. Yes, my family's from Mexico. Um, I'm trying to figure out what color would look nice. See, this would look nice in orange. But it would also look fine in black. <laughs> All right, so we use another color for the next bunch of stuff, but I think I'm going to use black with this one. I think it would look cute. I think your grandmother has an ultimate organic lemon leaf tea. Sounds delicious. It's so good. That lemon leaf tea is amazing. Every time I go to our house, I have to have it. <laughs> like a must. I went to Walmart and I got this last night. I love it. <laughs> I'll definitely switch it up though. Like some of these could look cute in pink also. I like the orange. Look pretty with the orange. We're almost out of the black bobbins, but there's a little bit left in a lot of them. <laughs> okay. And then my thread. Let me look. 
load it up here. One moment. What printer do you use and does 65 pound cardstock you use not cause a paper jam? Um, no, not in my paper, not in my printer. I could do up to 110 pound. There's no problem. Um, I have the Eco Tank uh, Epson Eco Tank ET two seven five zero. Is it? Yeah, ET two seven five zero. That is the printer that I have. I've always, I have been using the Eco Tank printers for a long, long time. Um, but I haven't really encountered a printer that couldn't do sixty-five pound cardstock. That's pretty. Um, that's pretty uh, common. I don't see why most printers would have a problem with that. It's not even heavy. Dark green would look good. Yeah, dark green would look good. I'm going to do a lot of days of embellishments, so <laughs> I'm going to do a lot of colors. So I try and sandwich them so that way they kind of touch in the middle. And then I put this part on top and then I can sew confidently down the middle knowing it's going to catch both peepers. So let's do that. Let me bring you guys down actually because I'm going to be here for a minute. <laughs> I could just tell this always takes longer than I think it's going to take. <laughs> always, always happens that way. Okay. So now you're down here with me on my sewing machines. This is. Daisy, do you ever use fabric on your embellishments? Uh, no, because I don't have a lot of fabric to match. However, I'm going to get my lace out though. Now that I remember that. Let me use a zigzag stitch here. I should get my my lace. The ink lasts forever, and it really does. It does last a long, long time. And I'm happy now because they didn't used to um, sell the bottles individually for this particular printer. I don't know why. Um. But now they do, so I'm happy about it. Let me go get my scraps. Actually, I don't need to go anywhere. They're right here. <laughs> I don't need to go anywhere at all. They're right, right here. So I like to use some lace also. <clears throat> Here's some right here. And I'll just go right there. Everything's down. Okay, make sure everything's good. Okay, here we go. Right there. Isn't that special? <laughs> I love it. I love it. Let's see what else we can do. I have some doilies. Might be a little much. <laughs> it might be. No, I kind of like it just like this for this one anyways. In particular. Add cut up ochres. I've been thinking about going to the store and just buying like pretty dresses to cut up for fabric. Because fabric is so expensive, y'all. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness. It is expensive. <laughs> I don't know why, but it is. I have like little bits here of like, I don't know what this is, some like cotton fabric of sorts. Uh, for right now, this kind of just looks good on its own. Let's see here. I 
need to go to the thrift store. It is I take clothes, they're getting rid of, tear it up, and use it. I'm going to do that. I need to go to the shops. Let's see. What else? What else do I have? Mm. This is kind of pretty. Let's see. It's a little bit messy, but that's okay. That is all right. You have fabric for sale, Keisha says. Cool. And I literally don't have any. <laughs> I feel like I don't. <laughs> Oops, I touched the camera. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. I think I, I did buy a new fabric that I think will look beautiful with the cover for a journal for with this paper pad. I've been taking Dakota's advice and looking through the remnant section of my Walmart. <laughs> one by one, I catch a pretty one. But it doesn't happen all the time, unfortunately. Okay, let's see. We got some lace there. Actually, let's put the lace behind the gold. Okay. I'm going to have to sandwich this again. <laughs> so that. Then this. And then this. I don't know if it'll hold. Okay. Let's see. You always check the remnant section. Yeah, it is random. So I did, to, like, today, well, I went last night, and I noticed they had this. This here was 97 cents. So I got it. It's just this, like, blue fabric. Like, very, like, springtime. So I thought that was cute. And then I got this from the Revenant section. And I think this one, ugh, so it's like a light green almost. Yeah, it's almost like a light green cotton. And I think it would look pretty with this, this hound's tooth. I think that would look pretty with this kind of embellishments, this kind of paper pad. I think it would look good. If you go to Walmart, get the flat panels. They're only 99 cents. Yes, I've been picking certain ones up. So I think these two would look pretty um, as a cover for these paper pads. I have some really pretty fabrics. So shabby too, I can always take pictures. Sure, I am always looking for a good deal on fabrics. Since I don't have any, it's so sad. <laughs> I've never, like I said, I've never really been interested in fabrics though. I mean, I've gone to a lot of fabric stores in Mexico, but I'm only really interested in the lace. I would be down to take a look. You don't care for the hound's tooth. 
I don't know if it's going to be a spring journal. <laughs> I just like the mix of those two uh, fabrics. It reminds me of that guy from, um, from what's it called? From Project Runway, Mondo. I don't know why. It looks like his type of deal. <laughs> so I thought that was cool. <laughs> I didn't buy them to use them together. I just think they would look nice together. At least for one journal. I don't think there's enough fabric there to make two with the hound's tooth. Hound's tooth. Who came up with that name? <laughs> They're fired. <laughs> okay, here we go. So these are pretties. So far, are really fast to make. Oh, I keep forgetting that I'm supposed to do. Oh my gosh. Okay, so Gail did this thing where she just like kept sewing them together, kind of like in a row, and I keep forgetting to do that. You could obviously use different stitches, but I just keep using a uh, zigzag stitch just to make it easier for myself. Oh. Oh, I got stuck. Let's move it along. <laughs> Why is it stuck, though? Come on. <laughs> I mean, that's a pretty solid stitch. <laughs> Let's see what is going on. Okay, is everything okay? Everything seems to be okay. Okay. Let's see if we can finish this up now. Let's see, let's see. I'm trying to get my light over here. Sorry, Daisy, I'm late. What are you working on tonight? I love watching... I love working with fabrics. I wish I knew how to sew and make things with fabrics I have. I can't make things with fabrics, like sew fabrics together. But we're actually making um, scrap embellishments with a new paper pad. We're working with a new paper pad this week. And we're just putting little scraps of lace in between some of them. So we just ripped up like three paper pads and then... Um, we're layering them together to just make little embellishments that we're going to use to decorate tags. And we could also decorate the page with these. Could do a lot of things with these. In the next batch, I think I'm going to use die cuts. So that's what we've been doing so far. Hey, Mama Megs. <laughs> Watch out, you guys. The coolest kid is here. <laughs> Oh my gosh, why I want to go? Oh, right, because I stitched in the same spot. Okay, okay, here we go, here we go. Now we're trucking, now we're trucking, okay. So, this is going well. Got a bunch of them to do, and I always underestimate how long it's going to take to sew them together, like 100% of the time. <laughs> He's going to bed. Gotta keep working. Okay, get this over here. Okay, what's everybody saying? Hey, Christy. If you're new here, let us know so we can welcome you officially to the Juncture of Cool Kids. <laughs> Official. 
Otherwise, you can't sit with us. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so silly. <laughs> Mostly new, just kept missing lives. Oh, well. Welcome, welcome. Thanks for finally joining us on a live. Okay, okay, okay. It's a little bit messy, but that's okay. These embellishments are meant to be messy. Try not to worry about these embellishments too much. It looks pretty. Let's see here. Those are great. Love the colors. Okay, I'll work on some myself. Sorry, ladies. Big hello. To all of you. Hey, Norma. These are so easy, though. And they make the page look so pretty, or whatever tag you're putting them on. Just looks so pretty. As long as you use pretty papers. I think it's the look to go for right now. I always critique my work and find faults everywhere. Yeah. Yeah. You must be human, Nancy. You must be human, girl. <laughs> we all do that. We all do that. Yeah. Definitely. Like, I remember when I used to do, like, greeting cards, and I used to go to events to sell my greeting cards. I would have to let my husband do the talking, because he was so sweet about, like, selling my work. And he was, like, even more excited about my work than I was, and it was really nice. <laughs> it was really sweet. He could sell. He was, like, more amazed about everything. And, you know, it was it was just really cute the way he would sell my stuff. <laughs> going on right now oh my goodness oh my bobbin is like all jammed up uh. okay i need a new bobbin Ooh, that jacked up that paper but not enough that i can't use it <laughs> so okay okay let's get another black bobbin out here I'm going to need, need another one of these. <laughs> I'm going to need like 12 of those. Daisy, do you have a favorite color? Uh, black. <laughs> What's my favorite color? Black. <laughs> definitely. Definitely. Yep, I'm always wearing black. I don't know, I just apparently turned all my branding into black color. It's just, I don't know, I'm always, black is the color I always go for <laughs> by default. Let's see here. This here, and then this one here. When I tell people, like, yeah, I always wear black, and they're like, oh, that's right, you always do wear black. <laughs> so they realize. 
Yeah, I always wear black clothes. Or I'll wear like all black, but I'll have like a colored sweater or something. Or I'll wear all black, but I'll have one like burgundy shirt. <laughs> My my sister, my my husband, my husband, my brother's what girl girlfriend was always getting mad at me because I was always only wearing black. And we took some family photos, and I found a gray shirt, and she's like, "Yes, we're gray." <laughs> Couldn't sew off the fabric or paper without it doing that. I have to feed the pieces through together. Close. Wow. <sighs> Sewing machines are so tough sometimes. Okay, we're going. We're going. Now, like I said, these could pretty much decorate anything. Envelopes, tags, the page itself. So I like to get a lot of these together. That way I can decorate a lot of things. And it'll go it'll all follow the same thing. The same color scheme. Daisy got your mystery back today. Absolutely wonderful mix. Playing with those beat treasures right now. Love it. Oh, thank you so much. I'm so happy that you love it. I hope you it sparks some inspiration in you and you get to work. <laughs> Um, Christy says, I think black is nice besides less chance of stain. <laughs> Not in my case. I always seem to drop, like, Alfredo sauce on my black sweater. <laughs> it's terrible. Maybe that's just me, though. I'm a mess. <laughs> I'm a mess. Here we go. We're almost done here. We got these two more to do. And then we'll make more. <laughs> we'll make more. And the next ones I'm going to make with die cuts. So I'm excited. I'm excited. And I'm so excited. And I just can't hide it. I know, I know, I know, I know. And I think I like it. <laughs> okay, let me get these paper clips out the way. And then we're going to make more um, little embellishments. This time using a little die cut. They're not the little ones, but they're di they're die cuts. <laughs> Regardless. Okay, let me get everything put away. Let me get everything put away. Okay, so here's the I forgot this is <laughs> I forgot it's all on the line. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's too funny. I totally forgot. I spaced out on the fact that it's in a long line. <laughs> Let me get these cut up because I was going to show them off and now I can't. <laughs> Who is here? Hey, Betty, the coolest of the kids. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome, 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 welcome. See, I'm just cutting these up because I forgot that they were in a chain. <laughs> At least, I mean, I do waste less thread, I guess, this way. So it's not a bad thing. But goodness me, I forgot. Goodness. Okay, so we're going to continue with embellishments this whole week. Because... It'll help me make uh, junk journals faster, basically. <laughs> if I focus on embellishments one week, and then next week we'll focus on junk journals. Okay. 
just like we did the week before that. Okay, so here are the embellishments that we've made so far. Uh, pretty much exclusively just using three pieces of paper and different little lengths and then different color combinations that kind of went together. And I did use a couple paper pads by DCWV. And uh, Daisy, I've downloaded your French Classified and Prayer Cards. They are so beautiful. Thank you so much for your support, uh, Lydia. Thank you, thank you. I hope you do enjoy your printables, and I hope they serve you well. Print them out in different sizes, and you'll get more uh, use and fun out of them. Smart way to do that, Daisy. Yes, and then, like I said, I just then it takes me one day to make a junk journal, and that's a lot easier <laughs> on me. <laughs> so this is fun, though. I really, really, honestly, this this is so much fun to do. I could do this all day. <laughs> Just these embellishments. Okay, so we're getting down to the last ones. Aren't they pretty? Thank you guys for hitting that thumbs up button. If you guys enjoy junky journal videos, I do pretty much post a video every single day. So go ahead and hit subscribe so that way you don't miss a video that I post. I go live Monday through Friday at 9 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. If you guys are around, come and join the cool kids here. We're hanging out, making junk journal stuff. Okay, so those are the ones we just made. Now, let's make some using some of my die cuts. Let me go get them. They're off to the side over here. And let me get my camera in place a little bit up above. Bird's eye view here. We're up. We're up again. We're up. Whoa. Okay. Okay, so we're at 45 people. All right. Very cool. If you're new here, let me know that you're new. We can welcome you to the cool kids. Uh, if you're new here and you haven't joined our Facebook group, uh, you are more than welcome to join the Junk Journal Cool Kids. Uh, we post all, all sorts of junk journal related stuff for you to be inspired by, of course. So you're more than welcome to join us. Yes, uh, aren't these awesome? These die cuts are from my mystery boxes. If you guys want to check that out, let me get a link to that. Um, they're over in my store and they're 50% off right now, actually. So you guys can take advantage of that. Actually, I almost closed the live page. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, thank you. Yay, JNOS for you. I remember your name. I remember seeing your name around. Uh, I love those die cuts, too. Aren't they precious? Aren't they beautiful? Okay, so these are the ones that we're going to be using today. And I'm going to be making more of these collages. So let me get everything out the way. Okay. Okay. Where I'm missing, okay, I'm missing this foil one. Okay. Sometimes having them in these bags makes it a little bit easier because I kind of just like grab stuff and just go with it instead of like looking through items. And I still get a good look because it still looks really good. And it keeps it a little bit more organized than when I pull everything up. But whatever. <laughs> I end up pulling stuff out anyways. Okay, so that. That and that would be pretty. With, of course, a butterfly. We got to go with the butterfly. Because that would be gorgeous. So I do want to thank you guys for your support with buying uh, these um, mystery boxes. I have a lot of them right now that I have on uh, <laughs> that you guys have purchased. I need to get busy to making them. <laughs> That's the unfun part. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's fun. It's fun. It's just work, you know. <laughs> you got to sit there with my little machine and get to work. <laughs> it's a fun hustle. It's a fun hustle. <laughs> 
Okay, so we got these right here, and I think these look pretty. And I'm pretty much just going through my little die cuts and kind of just grabbing something that is appropriate of size, such as this little crown. I think that's a little bit too small. I'm going to use this shoe, maybe. This shoe's a little bit too big. You've been subbed for a while now. I don't know how. I missed the FB page. Uh-oh. <laughs> it's a well-known secret. Well, <laughs> Well, hidden secret, I meant to say. <laughs> Let's see what. Okay, these little. That would cover everything. <laughs> Let's see. No, that's too big. All these things here. This little bottle is too big. And I normally have these in a smaller size too, but I just didn't have time to print them out and get them cut out yet. Uh, ma, 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 ma. This little paintbrush. Oh, I like this little lantern for some reason. I think it looks cute. I've been... Okay, so we'll put that over there to the side. Okay. So let's keep going here. These are pretty basic. Let's see. Yeah, that could go there like that. Okay, I can see it. I can see it. This one might need a bigger. Those clips that I got from Crafty Arena, maybe. Maybe, oh yeah, we're also going to um do a meetup in California, in Southern California, around my hometown of Oxnard, California. We are going to be doing a cool kids meetup um, with little Rhonda Lee and with Pink Oddbird. She's also going to be there. Um, so it ought to be a lot of fun. So you guys are welcome to join us. We're going to be going around town and I guess we're going to be, I guess Pink Oddbird knows all the hot spots for junk journal supplies. You just got a scan and cut so you'll be playing in my store. Ooh, Betty, you are in for a lot of fun. You are in for a lot of fun. I just put the humidifier in my room. Uh, do you pay for plane tickets? <laughs> no, I live in Nevada. <laughs> Oh, do <laughs> for you to come out, you mean? <laughs> I'm like, what do you mean? I live here. I live here. I don't need to fly. <laughs> I see what you mean. <laughs> oh my gosh, Keisha, you had me worried for a second. I'm like, what? <laughs> you got me. You got <laughs> yeah. Um, well, I have a friend that actually lives in Florida. She does all kinds of um. She does like those uh, craft get-togethers. What are those things called when you get together and you craft? Everybody crafts. Um, I haven't gone to them in so long. I forgot what they were called. <laughs> you know, everybody goes and everybody crafts. What's it called? Um, it's like an event. <laughs> what are they called? Like retreats or something? I was going to try and holler at her. Retreat? Yeah, one of those. <laughs> they like rent a hotel and you can stay there and you can craft together. I was thinking of contacting her and seeing if we can do something with junk journals. I don't know if everybody would go to Florida. I don't know who's close to Florida. This would be cute. And I could probably do that out here, but she's out there. <laughs> so that would be fun, actually. That would be fun. Let's see if I can do something with this, this green. And this gold. I think I keep making them too small. I need to make them bigger, though. 
BRB. Okay. I know more people are prone to want to come to Las Vegas. <laughs> people love it here. People love Las Vegas. I'm just Florida. I have family in Saratoga. Very cool. I've never been out to Florida in my life. Never. So it would definitely be a first for me to go to the East Coast like that. That would be a first. Let's see, it's a little bit too big. I need to make them a little bit bigger. I'm making the collages so small for, <laughs> for these die cuts. They're too big. Let's see, I have this little shoe. This little shoe might fit. Right there, the little shoe would go cute right there. Vegas is easier to get to cheap flights. Yeah. Some will do it with smaller groups and have them at their homes. Yeah. My house is too small. <laughs> I wish I could invite y'all over. <laughs> It's so tiny. Let's see. Yeah, and then like events are, it's just proven that people come to Vegas. If an event is held in Vegas, people will come more. It's so weird. It's because like they can bring their spouse and stuff and have a vacation while they go to work type of thing. So that's cool. I get it. I get it. Daisy could host a retreat. <laughs> I've been thinking about uh, an event like that. Something. With junk journal related stuff. I think we need one. I think we deserve one, right? <laughs> right? Who's with me? <laughs> Who's with me, darn it? It could happen. It could happen. You never know. You never know. I'm sure stranger things have happened. It's possible. I want something like that. Like an event of some sort. I think it would be awesome. Okay. There we go, we can put this over here. Now they're getting slightly larger, which is fine because the die cuts are pretty large themselves. So we should do larger parts, larger papers. Let's see. This and this. And what else could I do? Is pink going down the middle, maybe? That could work. I'm late, but you made it. Yes, Etta, you made it. Do a camp and craft. Camping and crafting in nature. Oh my gosh. I can't lie. I don't like camping. <laughs> I won't lie. <laughs> I am not an outdoor person. I am not. <laughs> Maybe if we got a nice cabin. <laughs> a nice fancy cabin. <laughs> I could just hear myself be so annoying. <laughs> talking about this, talking about that. I would have complained about everything. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, I need a huge uh, 
I'm going to need a huge um, hotel sized tent. <laughs> I am not, not an outdoor person. I'm terrible at it. I get so annoying. <laughs> I really do. It's terrible. Ooh, this one's all gold foil. Yes. Thumbs up for gold foil, you guys. <laughs> Thumbs up for gold foil. Out here saving lives. Yes, I would need the luxury RV. <laughs> How about we meet up at an, a luxury RV park? <laughs> How about that? <laughs> I'm the worst. Yeah, that would look pretty right here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Gold foil is, like, my obsession lately. I don't know why. <sighs> but I love me some gold foil. <laughs> Any paper pads with gold foil lately have just been catching my eye like crazy. Lately, it's all about gold foil for me. <laughs> I don't camp unless there is a bed and a shower and internet connection, right? I need internet connection, you guys. I need to go live during during the event. <laughs> oh, this butterfly would look so pretty. Let's do the butterflies. Oh my gosh, Dakota, I wanted to keep playing last night. <laughs> I really did. But like I said, if I didn't get off the game, I wouldn't have gotten off for a month. <laughs> I wanted to keep playing. But I had to be responsible. <laughs> I'm terrible. I put my whole life on hold for that game. Oh my god. Game sucks my time. Okay, let's see here. Okay, okay. So we're just putting these scraps together here. Because they're going to look pretty. <laughs> I decided they will look beautiful. It's a big crown. <laughs> Let's do this right here with this little spool. I can want to, girl, don't tell me because I did day and night for like two months <laughs> telling you that game ruined my life. <laughs> Two straight months, that's all I pretty much did, was just play Fallout. It was, it was so bad. <laughs> it was so bad, but it felt so good. <laughs> that game was awesome. <laughs> no complaints from me on that game. Wait, I didn't put gold foil here somewhere. It needs gold foil. There we go. Just like that. Hit it with the foil. And then a little camera. I got really into playing it with other people. That's how I really enjoy playing that game. You remember those days? Ugh, video games, yo. And it's just this one video game because, no, I don't, I've never been interested in playing any other video games. It's so weird. Fallout and Diablo. I'm all about Fallout. Mm. I ruined my life. <laughs> 
let's see, let's see. Oh, we got this little bottle. Got these little bottles we can do something little with. Let's see. I got this one right here. All of the Fallout games, though. I'm all, all about those Fallout games. <laughs> it's the only game I'm telling you I've ever wanted to play. Oh, that doesn't look good. I got all these little things I'm working with here. Got all these little die cuts to pick from, and I'm still having a hard time. Okay, this little bottle. There's this little bottle here. Put it right. Nope, that doesn't look good. Nope, that doesn't look good though. <laughs> Um, 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 let's see. I only got nine more minutes till I gotta start sewing. Otherwise, it takes forever to sew. Okay, we'll just do this little crown then. Um, what's everybody saying? Keisha says she's back. Christy says, had, had to love the radioactive rats. Oh my goodness. Or mole rats. The mole rats. They're terrible, those mole rats. <laughs> okay, we'll do this right here. And we'll do this other crown. I need more clips. Clips. I used to play World of Warcraft. Tinana says, I don't like camping, but going to the beach sounds great. Oh, yes, we can go camping alongside the beach. That would be different. Uh, Max says, I don't have a desk anymore. I think I need a bucket. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Keisha says she lives up by white sandy beach as well. Jeez, Keisha. <laughs> Good for you. <laughs> that sounds awesome. I'm jealous. <laughs> I'm jealous. Uh, Michelle says, I just got home from work. I'm glad I caught this. Ooh, I'm glad you're here, girl. Glad to see ya. Yeah, Keisha, that sounds terrible. <laughs> Why would I ever want to live next to the beach, Keisha? <laughs> I'm so jealous. I'm hating so hard. <laughs> or World Cup. Never, never played World of Warcraft. But those games, they just, next thing you know, you've been playing for three hours and you're like, what happened? <laughs> What happened on my day? <laughs> I think I was supposed to do stuff. It just happens. Okay, we're going to put these together here. And let's see what else we get. Let me turn this around. Maybe I'll get different papers. <laughs> Okay, here's this. It's a pretty big piece. And we can put it together like that with a pretty by itself. Okay, this one's going to be pretty big. Let's see, maybe we cut it in half. I do that sometimes, cut stuff in half, and then I get two of them. Let's see what's everybody saying. Oh, come on, Daisy, don't. You have oceanfront property in Nevada. Yeah, I have 30 miles of oceanfront property. What's it to you? <laughs> I have 30 acres of 
beachfront property in Las Vegas. <laughs> what now? What? What? <laughs> no, I miss it. I miss it. Because, you know, I grew up next to the beach. Uh, I need to go back. I'm going to go back. Okay, well, I already said I was going to go back. <laughs> next, next month, I'm going to go back. I'm too excited. I like to go to the beach every time I go. Even if I don't go into the water, I just want to go see and make sure that it's still there. <laughs> uh, let's see what everybody's saying. Okay. Max says she's never seen the beach. That's crazy. You need to go. You need to take a weekend and go. <laughs> uh, Judy says, I got that way with Fable 3. It's addictive. Once he starts, it's like he can't stop. He'll play all day. I... I, that's why I had to stop playing last night. I was playing with um, with Dakota, and I had to stop playing. I'm like, you know what? I gotta get off because if I don't, like, I'll literally just play for five months straight and not <laughs> do any work, and that's not good. <laughs> like, I gotta go. <laughs> I can feel it. <laughs> it's a never-ending quest. It's always a never-ending quest. <laughs> Uh, let's see, Sandra, Sandra's here, the beach is still here, well, I need to know, I need to check that out for myself, I don't know, <laughs> I need to see for myself, okay, here we go, we have a couple more things we could do, let's get in here, let's get into these scraps here, ooh, these, this is pretty, that's beautiful. Probably end up covering it all because we always do. <laughs> Somehow we always end up covering everything up. I don't know how it happens. Okay, we have these three things here. I was there. There was uh, it was three scorch beast. That was insane. And I kept getting distracted trying to get back into the game. <laughs> and I kept fighting all the, I kept fighting off all the uh, scorch, all the scorch that were kept coming towards you. So I helped that way. <laughs> and I did die once. <laughs> I hate dying in that game. It's so lame. It's the lamest. I must see the beach in the Philippines just to make sure it's still there. Yes, I need to know it's still there. The way I remember it. <laughs> Gotta make sure for yourself. There's this little bottle. Let's see if the little bottle. Let's see. What else could I do here? I'm just looking through all my die cuts, seeing what I could do. It's not tall enough. And these scissors. Okay, we'll do the scissors. That's fine. That'll work. Okay, I got two more minutes to make stuff, and then I gotta get to sewing. That's my rule now, is I, got, I can make collages for a half hour, and then I gotta... So, because it always takes me half hour to sew every half hour it took me to make the collages. <laughs> I have discovered that. Weird discovery to make, but I discovered that. <laughs> that would look pretty with that. Although every time we go to the beach, I always say to my kids that we bought half the beach home with us because everything is full of sand oh my gosh Ooh, love hawaii who's in hawaii i live on maui wow and the beaches are wonderful the ocean is very healing mahalo all you wonderful people going to call it a night okay you have yourself a good night blue chill how cool is that from hawaii so cool i want to be in hawaii <laughs> I want to be in Hawaii. Why don't I live in Hawaii? 
Oh yeah, because I can't afford it. That place is so expensive. I know some people have like their family homes for years, but that place, it sounds so cool. <laughs> Everybody always takes awesome pictures from there. This little teapot. Little teapot. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, I can pick the shoe. Yeah, let's put the shoe. It'd be cute. Pick the shoe. Ooh. Okay, okay. Now I need to sew these together. Give me one moment, because I want to do one more. I want to do one more. Okay, very cool, very cool. That goes like that, that goes like that. Why do I want to keep using this? I keep wanting to use... Okay, this will work for this. Do you want to vacuum each kit? It comes right off with the sprinkle of baby powder. What? Okay, here we go with that. Okay, okay, so let's sew these together now. Let me get all this out the way. That goes back there. This goes over here. Paper goes in here. I've already used up so much of the gold papers. Not a lot left already. <laughs> Okay, so let's sew this together here. Okay. I'll just leave it like this so you guys can see, but it won't be too up close because I'm going to get back at it making these more of these collages for a little bit longer. Let's see here. Oh, and I wanted to use a different thread. Oh my goodness. I wanted to, use it. I wanted to see if I can use a dark green. I think I have green. Oh, I do. Yeah. I guess next time. I keep saying that and I keep forgetting. <laughs> Whoops. Whoops. Okay, let's get these soap up here. Okay, just zigzag on here. Um, it doesn't feel like rubbing sand off your skin. I love the look of sewing. It always says that. I always say that. It looks cute, right? I love the look myself. I love it. <laughs> I'm so glad I learned how to use the sewing machine. Just like, you know, I only know basic things about the sewing machine, but I'm so glad. Because it does add that little element. It's like an actual, like another piece of decoration without having to add, you know, thicker embellishments every time as you go. Okay, who's here? Cindy's here. Hey, Cindy. Okay, Daisy and everybody, I must get some sleep. Have a good night, everybody. Thanks, Daisy, for the inspiration. Have a good night, Mac. Good night, good night. Why did that error out? I don't know. I just said error. I don't know what's wrong with this thing. Like, get over yourself, sewing machine. Let's go. to do sewing machine these are gonna look so cute all 
I can just tell. If you guys are enjoying this video, please do hit that thumbs up button. Let's me know you guys are having fun tonight. If you guys want to watch more junk journal related videos, I do post a video every single day. So you can join back tomorrow and I will have a new video posted. I go live Monday through Friday at 9 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. All welcome to join me sometimes we have um midday meetings uh here and uh i will let you guys know in my facebook group if we have a cool kids meeting during the afternoon usually it's either at 12 or 1 p.m pacific standard time and you guys are more than welcome to join me then there is my facebook group you guys are more than welcome to join and you guys can um, see uh, images and photos that my design team posts of their project, as well as other uh, Junk Journal Cool Kids that post on there. I'm not going to lie. When I changed the name, I thought, I'm like, I wonder if, like, actual kids are going to join. Like, what if, you know, Junk Journal moms, like, are like, oh, finally a kids group for junk journaling. I don't know. It hasn't happened yet. I'm gonna have to be like, sorry, Billy, you can't, you can't sit with us. <laughs> sorry, Billy, get out. <laughs> okay, Tommy, you have a good night, girl. <laughs> have a good night. I'm saying. I'm like, what if <laughs> actual kids try and join? <laughs> I gotta be like, sorry, kid, you're not cool enough. <laughs> you can't sit with us. <laughs> so sad. <laughs> Why you gotta do that to Billy? Because Billy should have known, Dakota. <laughs> should have known. <laughs> Not to mess with me. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm so weird. Poor Billy. <laughs> This one right here. This one came apart. No. No. Okay, here we go. Let's put that together, but it's missing one more piece over here. <laughs> I make no sense most of the time right now. <laughs> I realize this. <laughs> Let's get this here, right here. This, this, this right here. With this. And this right here with this. Okay, the last batch of embellishments I'm going to make, they're going to be with my vocabulary words once I find them. I'm sure they're going to be right around the corner, but I just got to look for them. Make beautiful journals. Thank you so much. Thank you. 
and those pieces look nice. <laughs> Sandra says with suspicious intent. <laughs> I don't know if I trust you, Sandra, with those eyes. Those side eyes, girlfriend. Get these little collages. Okay. Eh. I knew I had to have more gold foil than that paper pad gave. It had some gold foil, but I apparently I like a lot of gold foil now. Okay, so these are the embellishments that we made with the little die cuts from my mystery boxes. Check thrift stores. I am. I'm gonna. I want to. I've just been lazy. Because if I want the car, I have to go drop off my husband <laughs> at work. And sometimes I don't go to bed till 4 in the morning. And I'm just not in the mood to go drop him off. <laughs> So it's been terrible. I need to get another car or something. One day, one day. Look how pretty. A lot of these. I think these went pretty well. Pretty well, I think. And then this shoe. Okay, so the last batch of embellishments that we're going to make. Oh, and I didn't sew these ones together. Whoops, hang on one moment, one moment, one moment. I gotta sew this together here. Why did it get caught? Why is this happening to me? Okay, okay. <laughs> so my bobbin is like stuck in here somehow. I don't even know what to do. Okay. Okay. That bobbin is done. <laughs> it had a nice way of telling me it was done. Get another one. This time Daisy's ready with all the bobbins this time. Okay. Little perfume bottle right here. One moment. One moment. Okay. 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 Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Let's see what everybody's saying. Oh my god. That was a shoe. <laughs> they all look the same, girls. Okay. It's okay. <laughs> I'm going to take that machine I found to be checked over. The bobbin threader needs to be fixed, but it works. Hey! Hey! That's awesome. Hang on. I gotta go get these vocabulary words. Oh, where are they? They're somewhere. I always find them after I'm done doing what I wanted them for. They're somewhere. Where are they? Goodness, that's what I wanted to do at the end. Oops, I dropped my lotion. Oh my gosh, where are those words? Oh my goodness. I'm telling you, it always happens to me and I always find them right afterwards. And then that's it. And then, oh my gosh, they are gone. I don't see them anywhere this time. Oh my god. I might have to call it a night then, because that's what I was going to do at the end. And now I'll have to come back. Yep, I don't see them. That's terrible. Okay. Okay, well, we're done then for the night. <laughs>
We did some awesome collage in here. I'm going to do more of these because I want to make some more to sell. While I have a lot of pieces, that's what I need to do. So look at this nice little pile of stuff that we made tonight. That's fun. <laughs> I wish I knew where those freaking words were. <sighs> I just don't see them anywhere. I don't see them. I don't see them. I don't see them. I don't know where they could be. I can't remember the last time I seen them. I guess it's been a minute since I seen them. Yep. They're not anywhere here. So I'm going to call it a night, you guys. And I'll be back tomorrow. At 9 p.m. I don't know if I'll be, I might be back during the afternoon just to make some more of these. If you guys want to join me tomorrow afternoon to make more of these little stuffs here, you're more than welcome to join me. But I'm going to call it a night for now. I got some stuff I got to do. Um, but I do want to thank you guys for joining me tonight. We'll make some different little embellishments tomorrow. We'll figure out something. We'll decorate. We'll do something fun. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you guys for joining me. Um, I had a lot of fun tonight um, doing these little collages and hanging out with all the cool kids tonight. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out, you guys. Join the Facebook group if you haven't. So that way you guys can see if we're going live during the afternoon. Peace out, you guys.